up you guys if you're new to this channel my name is Jordan I actually shared this channel with my sister Haley but today I'm solo and we are cooking breakfast I'm actually gonna show you guys one of my favorite recipes of all time I've literally been making this my entire life and this is called migas it's basically an egg breakfast dish it's kind of similar to like a chilaquiles type of thing but it's super super quick and easy so let's just jump right into it so I already have my pan warming up with some olive oil in it. It's like on medium high heat right now. And what I'm gonna do is just grab some corn tortillas. I always change up the amount of tortillas I'm using, sometimes two, sometimes three, just depending on how hungry I am or how many people I'm cooking for. Um, but today I'm pretty much starving. So I'm gonna use three corn tortillas and you can cut these up if you want them more uniform or you can do what I do. I just like to rip them up and I'm gonna kind of rip them up into like one inch chunks, but you can make them as big or small as you want. But I'm just gonna throw them into my pan with the hot oil in it. Okay, so once you have all the corn tortillas in the oil, you're just gonna kind of mix everything around. You want the corn tortillas to get a little hard, but not crunchy like a chip. So just use a tiny little bit of oil in your pan. So I'm just gonna make sure that all the corn tortillas are evenly coated in the oil and just wait till they are nice and crispy. Okay, so once the corn tortillas are just about crispy, at this point, I always like to add some greens. You totally don't have to do this, but you can also take this opportunity to really add whatever you want. You can do onions, tomatoes, mushrooms, you can do meat. You could really do whatever you want in this dish, and that's why I love it so much. But today I'm gonna do a little bit of spinach, and I'm gonna do a little bit of arugula as well. Just kinda wanna get my greens in for the day. So I'm just gonna mix those in and just get everything nice and wilty. Okay, so everything's looking pretty good in the pot at this point, so I'm gonna go ahead and add my eggs. I did three eggs today, and I'm just gonna throw them right in the pan with the tortillas and my greens. Once I have the eggs in, I'm also going to take this opportunity to add a little bit of seasoning. I like to do a little bit of Himalayan salt, so I'll do a dash of that. I'll do a little bit of black pepper. And then last but not least, just a little bit of garlic salt. So just super simple on the seasonings, but you can add whatever you want. So I'm just gonna kind of mix everything up, make sure everything's nice and incorporated, all the seasoning is incorporated. This is super quick, fast, and easy, you guys, so I love it. Also, once I add the eggs in, I definitely turn down the heat to more of a low to medium heat just because I don't want the eggs to burn. And once the eggs are almost cooked, I'm gonna go ahead and add some cheese. I like to use the Mexican blend. This is my favorite. And I just like to sprinkle this all over the top. Yum. All right, so once the eggs are just about done, I'm gonna go ahead and turn the heat off and just let everything kind of just finish cooking in the pan. Make sure the cheese is nice and melty and everything. And that's basically it. Like I said, this is so quick and simple. So I'm gonna go ahead and just give this a couple more minutes to finish cooking up, and then I'm gonna show you how I plate it. All right, you guys, so here's what the dish looks like when it's done. I pretty much slather this with, I don't know if this is weird to you guys, but I use ketchup and then a ton of tapatio. I freaking am obsessed with tapatio. Um, so yeah, it's super delicious, really filling, and it literally took me like five minutes or less. So if you guys have never tried this, go ahead and give it a try and let me know what you think in the comments below. If you guys like to see cooking videos, give this video a huge thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.